that's the workout. <laughs> just kidding guys, we're just getting started. It is March 23rd, so it's 6.30 in the morning and we're about to get into a lower body workout. Let's do it. We are home, it's time to shower, not open the computer because I do have to make a trip to Starbucks today because my Wi-Fi here is being super annoying, my video won't upload so we're going to go steal some Wi-Fi from Starbucks today. Um, so I'm not going to open the computer quite yet, I'm going to shower first, make some breakfast and then we're going to head out. Before I go ahead and get into my breakfast, I am going to show you guys what my current supplement stack is just because I've been getting some questions. So I want to show you guys kind of where I'm at with my supplements and what I'm using right now. So we got some amino IV, which I love to use pre-workout, in between meals, basically at any time of the day. And this is essentially for recovery and to help your body from going to, into a catabolic state, which means that your body starts using muscle for energy. And then we got some high volume, which is a pump enhancer, which I like to mix with my alpha mean pre-workout. And alpha mean is a fat burner, but it also does have some caffeine in it, so it can be considered a pre-workout as well. So I mix both of these together, pre-workout, true curcumin, true multivitamin, a probiotic, and spirulina. And these three four and <laughs> these four i have once a day these i have three times a day and once a day and true curcumin is for inflammation a multivitamin you guys know it's just filled with all kinds of vitamins and minerals and then we have the probiotic which you guys know it's important to keep a healthy gut flora and digestion and then we got some spirulina which honestly has like a million benefits it's great for digestion recovery and just all kinds of things if you're not too familiar with it i would definitely recommend looking into it and then we got some true zma which i have before bed for better recovery and to get better rest and i almost forgot this guy right here so this is my greens drink i've talked about this so many times on my channel and i would highly recommend using it for anyone even if you do get enough vegetables in your diet just because it has a big variety of vitamins and minerals and just all kinds of things that you would get from having a lot of vegetables in your diet it's your daily serving of vegetables in one scoop um i hate this brand it tastes so bad and i really wanted to go with one that i like that i've tried before but this is a way better content and it even has a probiotic blend so that's why i went for this one and i guess the taste is worth the content but like it tastes so bad like so bad <laughs> 
<laughs> it's the Garden of Life brand. I'm not sure if they have the Progressive brand here in the States, but in Canada they do. So if you can get your hands in the Progressive brand, um, veggie greens are called. Definitely get those, but I just got these because I ran out and I needed something to keep me going. So I guess I'll have to finish this entire thing. It smells like cow poop and it kind of tastes like it a little bit too. <laughs> got some banana some chocolate popper Quaker poppers or something and then some enlightened cocoa dusted broad beans and some peanut butter butter dig in and the protein part was made with some pea science select protein and 150 grams of strawberries okay right, so we have some strawberry breeze amino IV in here Got my computer, external hard drive, headphones, all that jazz in there, phone, and we're ready to go. Found a Starbucks, now we need a drink and some Wi-Fi. Let's do it. <laughs> He's gonna be on YouTube, yeah I am. Yeah. Um, do you guys have skinny mocha syrup here? Yeah. You do? Okay, yeah. sweet. Um, I'll get a venti iced americano with four pumps of skinny mocha. So I got my drink here. It has a skinny mocha syrup everywhere, and it makes my day every single time that I ask them. They say yes. You do have your skinny mocha syrup, so that's what I got. And then I got some Wi-Fi, so it's time to upload the video. Straight up to my face. Oh. So it is currently 2:19 p.m. I had planned to be in Starbucks for like two hours an hour <laughs> four hours later and I am done I just kind of like found things to do as I went and then I just sat there and like I kind of like the environment I was very focused a lot more focused than I am when I'm home and I just kind of lost track of time and I was having fun working I got like my video uploaded um, sent out some client plans also got my store all set up on Amazon so I can start selling my B headbands on there I just gotta figure out a couple more things with the manufacturers but then I'm like good to go and start selling on Amazon and stuff so I just found things to do um, I'm also gonna start working on a new website and I just stayed busy and it felt really really good yesterday I had a very off day I like I woke up and I just didn't really feel like myself I felt very off just very like disconnected and a big part of the reason is because I haven't really been doing my spiritual practices it's kind of like meditating or just taking some time for myself throughout the day and even though I haven't been completely like 100% working every single day like I've had time to hang out with my mom my friends that were in town or just time to hang out with family um, it's still not time that I was spending just by myself. Spending time with other people and not working is one thing, but just spending time by yourself, being present, and just practicing mindfulness is really, really different. So I haven't really been doing that, and yesterday it just like hit me like a ton of bricks. Like I honestly didn't want to get out of bed, and I just felt so exhausted. So um, 
I went to a restorative yoga class and it was like an hour and 30 minutes of just holding stretches and it was so amazing like I was able to really focus and just be present and it's been a while since I've done that and if you guys have been long-time subscribers and you've watched like my videos in the past month and a half then you guys know that I've been really trying to incorporate more like reading and meditating and just spiritual practices in my day-to-day -day life and after the drive to Florida and then going up the Arnold and just kind of being very busy with back-to-back -back stuff I kind of lost track of that just because I was so back to back with everything and just so busy and doing so many things all at once that I just kind of stopped making time for it. So my biggest focus right now that I am more kind of settled in Florida and um, I have more of a routine again is to get back to that and I just kind of let my Instagram fam, my little Instagram community know that like that's the reason why I was so quiet is because I was kind of keeping to myself and just focusing on myself because when we scroll through Instagram, when we go and watch TV, even though we think it's rest because we're not doing something that's like considered work it's not really resting or letting your body rest because you're still taking in the energy from what you're seeing on the internet or what you're seeing on TV so it's really important to make sure that we're doing this like just taking time for ourselves throughout the day and just like shutting everything out and just like being present and just being by yourself and not being surrounded or absorbing other people's energy so I'm really happy that I kind of I'm getting back to that and even just today I feel so much better after yesterday's class and just a full hour and a half of like nothingness except for full out mindfulness and just letting my body recover or even better so I definitely feel so so much better today like my energy is just like through the roof and my motivation and just everything like I feel re-energized so if you guys are feeling a little bit off and you're feeling very disconnected from the world and from yourself maybe meditation or just practicing more mindfulness throughout the day is something you should consider because I feel like when I am very connected with myself and I take time for myself throughout the day I'm a lot more productive and I just feel a lot better more energized and I just feel really really good so yeah I want to share that with you guys I'm hungry it's 2 25 p.m. and we're going home <laughs> Before I even look at that, I need some food, so put that in my room. Bye. And we're getting food. All right, guys. So we have 30 grams of spinach, 40 grams of shredded lettuce. There is 40 grams of mushrooms, 85 grams of sweet potato, 65 grams of slow cooked shredded chicken, 20 grams of reduced fat feta cheese, and then see these little seeds here. I brought them from Canada and it's called a salad topper and it has like all kinds of seeds and craisins and sunflower seeds, pumpkin seeds, cashews and there's 8 grams of that. I'm going to throw some ketchup in there, some salt and that'll be about it. And I also threw some of this Mrs. Dash in there. It's a lemon pepper seasoning blend and it tastes so freaking good in salads. If you haven't tried it before, I highly recommend trying it out. All right, YouTube fam, it's currently 7.11 p.m. and I have been sitting here basically since I got home. I don't really have much planned for the rest of the day. I do have to go grab some more water because I've been buying five gallon, yeah, five gallon water bottles here because I just can't drink the Florida tap water. So I do need to go to Publix eventually at some point within the next like hour because I don't want to leave later than eight. I just don't want to be out too late. So I do have to go grab some water eventually. I'm gonna grab a bite to eat right now though, before I go. Um, I don't really think I have much to share with you guys for the day. I'll show you what I'm gonna have for like my second last meal and that'll probably be it for this video because yeah. And I just finished editing another video. So it's definitely been like a very productive day. Check this out. It's my first IHOP experience. You should go watch this video if you haven't yet because yeah, IHOP is amazing. So it's been a very productive day and I am beyond happy about that. Um, and with that being said, I'm gonna grab a bite to eat and we'll chat in a little bit. All right guys, so we got some boiled chicken breast with some mushrooms. These were frozen, but I cooked them in a saucepan, I just put them in there frozen and then covered them and they kind of like cook and thaw out on their own. And then I threw in some mushrooms, threw in some chicken, added some soy sauce, a little bit of Splenda, some salt, and some Italian Mrs. Dash, and it's so good. Boom.
So what you see in that box are B science samples because me and my teammate Jenna Myers, we're gonna be doing a little workout on the beach slash hangout. And we asked P science, since we're both P science sponsored athletes, if um they would give us some samples so we can bring to the workout and hand it out to the girls that are coming to join us on the workout. So I am super excited for that. We're gonna be doing that on April 1st. If you are interested and you're wanting to join and you're in the Florida, South Florida area, then make sure to stay tuned on my Instagram or Jenna's Instagram. I will put it down here. It's always awesome to get to know you guys in person. So I'm really looking forward to this. Really, really thankful for P Science and just always being so supporting with everything that the athletes do. Um, obviously they didn't have to do that, but I just thought it'd be cool to bring some goodies because who doesn't love free samples, especially when they're from P-Science. So I'm gonna wrap up the vlog right here. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. If you did, you know what to do. Make sure you give the video a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed to my channel and you enjoy my content, then make sure you hit that subscribe button. And if you have any questions for me, anything to tell me, you know where to leave it down below. Thank you so much for tuning in guys and I will catch you in the next one.